Hi, it's Carol McLeod, and today I want to talk to you about my favorite season of all, Christmas. You know, this is the season of holly and mistletoe, of snowmen that dance and reindeers that sing, but those things are not the heart of the Christmas season. Those things are not the part of Christmas that I have chosen to celebrate. I'm so excited because today I'm going to read to you a portion of scripture that holds the true meaning of this season, Luke chapter one. And the angel said to her, do not be afraid, Mary, for you have found favor with God. And behold, you will conceive in your womb and bear a son, and you shall name him Jesus. And he will be great and will be called the son of the most high. And the Lord God will give him the throne of his father, David. And he will reign over the house of Jacob forever. And his kingdom will have no end. And Mary said to the angel, How can this be, since I am a virgin? And the angel answered and said to her, The Holy Spirit will come upon you, and the power of the Most High will overshadow you. And for that reason, the Holy Child shall be called the Son of God. You know, in those significant words that are found in Luke chapter 1, we discover the true meaning of Christmas. An angel invaded the life of an ordinary young woman and told her that she had found favor with God. That's what Christmas is all about. It's that we as humanity have found favor with God, the creator of the universe. And the favor that Gabriel spoke over Mary was not just favor pointed at her, but it was pointed at all of us who live even thousands of years after the birth of Jesus Christ. You know, one of the parts of the scripture that I love the most is when the angel Gabriel says to Mary, and the Holy Spirit will overshadow you. Listen, if you're looking for a prayer to pray this Christmas season, perhaps that should be your prayer. Holy Spirit, overshadow me. Overshadow my hopes and dreams and plans. Holy Spirit, overshadow my opinions and preferences and disappointments. And let the Christ child be born in me in a miraculous way this Christmas season.